Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jack, Jack Wala. I hope you're doing very well. I hope you're having a fantastic day. And I hope you're enjoying just life in general. And if you're not, I'm really sorry. Uh, it will get better, I promise you. It's just a bad day. It's just a bad day and you'll get through it. And that's what I tell myself every day. <laughs> but it's all good. I hope you're doing well. Anyway, so this film, this video even, is from my stream the other day. So uh, this was the first sim stream I did. Um, we decided that we were going to do a uh, little cottage, a uh, nice little thatched roof cottage with a little tiny conservatory on the side. Uh, it's become quite a theme for me now. I, I'm obsessed at the moment. Um, probably will be forever with conservatories. Um, and yeah, so that was kind of the general gist of it. And I'm going to say right now, the roofing was a nightmare to get exactly how I wanted. Um, you'll see me go through iterations and phases with it until it's perfect and I spend so much time on it and I hate I hate that I've done that I hate that I spent so much time uh <laughs> doing it but hey ho I mean is what it is um uh, uh, this build ends up being a double it's got a double bed so it's built for one or two sims it's a very open plan uh, apart from obviously the bedroom uh, it's got ends up having a nice patio garden and front garden like uh, all decorated so beautifully in my opinion personally <laughs> and I just absolutely love this build from head to toe like um, cottages and sort of like these Tudor homes at the moment I'm really enjoying building like I am really 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 enjoying like I absolutely love like the, the aesthetic of the outside and the what it allows you to do on the inside because you don't have to necessarily um stick with the same thing if you know what i mean uh you don't have to go completely old-fashioned with the inside of these builds you can go modern like i'm gonna be uploading a video later on um which is big is you've probably seen it on stream if you watched it it's a big tudor house and on the inside it's very modern it's like completely the opposite of what you'd be expecting and but this house is the what you'd expect it is very old-fashioned uh, you can imagine like your granny and your granddad living here for example uh, you can see maybe having a few cats or a couple dogs or something like uh that's the kind of vibe i've gone for it's cozy you'd be excited to go there and like have your lunch with your granny uh while she makes you a cake or something like that's the kind of vibe this is this is very homely especially with this little door from nifty knitting like this little door it is so cute. I know I absolutely adore it. Um, and I think those flowers are actually knitted. So they've got their knitted effects. They're not real, but they look real. Um, and I've gone very warm toned. So like warm browns, uh, like whites and creams for this cottage. Like it's a very, very, uh, it's, it's not like what I'd normally build as a cottage. Let's put it that way. Like normally when I do cottage, they're kind of like, they're dark, they're black, they're gray, uh, they're different and i just i just really love it i just love it from the sense that it's different from what i normally do the floor plan however was something very difficult i mean it did it really quick but trying to think to myself how i was going to fit a bathroom in this with the conservatory there so that ends up being the bedroom with the conservatory so which i think is a very i've not done that before i don't see it done very often it's not a very common theme but for this it worked because I, I I couldn't have the living room there because then you'd walk into like the bedroom or the kitchen which I didn't particularly uh, particularly want I guess at the end of the day I didn't really want that I want I I mean you could have walked into the kitchen I guess and had the bedroom at the back but then I wanted the back door coming off the kitchen like like the, the idea didn't work basically I had to do it this way. For it all to work and i think i really struggled with the wallpaper on this one because a lot of the wallpaper is very automatic like i remember the sims 3 the wallpaper wasn't automatic or if it was it was better but in this game some of the wallpaper is so frustrating to work with because you especially the ones that give you the pillars on like the edges like i don't understand why on some bits they give you the corner and some bits they don't which is very frustrating to me um but you can see what I mean, I spend a long time doing this roofing 
like I really struggled with it. I couldn't work out how to make it look. Every time I looked at it, I was like, there's something off about this. There's something off about this. Does this work? Does this work? I don't know. Um, uh, um. And I, I'm being an R a lot. <laughs> like if you watch stream, you'll remember. I was, I was there and I was like, oh my gosh. I don't know. I don't know if I like it. I, I'm really struggling with it. But the more I decorated and the more it came to look finished, the easier it was to be like, yeah, okay, I like this. Like, this is coming together now. Like, this is what I want, I think. Like, this, <laughs> this is how it's going to be. Um, but, like, I like it. It's cute. It is very cute. And it's very much what I envisioned. And I love it. I just absolutely love it. And I fit so much in this room, right? So this is the open plan, kitchen, dining, living area. And I fit, I do believe, a kitchen, dining room, I think there's a dining room, there's uh, a living room and a study, uh, all in this with fireplace and a washing machine, dryer. Like everything gets fit into this room. Like I, I shocked myself. <laughs> I, I like to push myself and fit things in. Um, and not make it look cramped. Like, I don't think it looks cramped. Like, like, I, I don't know how to explain it. I just think it really works in a really unique and fascinating way. Uh, the whole idea, though, is it's supposed to be cosy and not cramped. So, like, I'm hoping that it portrays that to people. Like, I hope it kind of comes across as really nice, like... Again, like, because this is only a two-sim home, like, you don't need loads and loads and loads of chairs everywhere or loads of, like, extra furniture or things to do because there's enough to do for the two of you. Um, like, that's, I think, the dining table. I know used it as kind of like a breakfast island. Like, I think in a lot of, like, older houses or, like, old people houses even, um, if this makes sense, like, the dining room is always in the kitchen. And, like, I know my grand's... Uh, house, my granny's house. In her, she's got like a, a kitchen that wraps around and then like a circle table in the middle of the kitchen. Um, and it's really cool. Like it's really, it's, it's what I'm so used to. Um, like even in my parents' house, like their dining room kitchen's in one room. And it's actually like you, I wouldn't have thought that it's actually quite small. Like it's not, it's like probably double the size of my bedroom. But it's so strange like, I just I can't really explain it but their dining room is in the kitchen and it's just nice um, they got a massive dining table and don't even use it though <laughs> I think in the time that I lived there um, with that dining table I used it oh it we had it for like a good like 12 years or something I'm pretty sure I used it like twice maybe five no probably about 10 times actually like we'd maybe have like a Sunday roast once every oh gosh <laughs> once every like three or four months like do you know what i mean and like, every other meal we would just sit in our own rooms and we just eat, <laughs> eat at the table and stuff but um i've got a very red theme on the inside like i've kept it very warm so here you can see me really bringing it together like i thought oh they only like a small tv uh they have a bookshelf here um like on the left of that that's where i put the uh, washer dryer unit and I just, I don't know, but there's something about this which I will just feel so cosy, just laying on that sofa, wrapped up in a blanket, the fire going, I just think it'd be so, so nice, really, I really do. Um, like, this is like, I've got a sideboard unit, um, I do fit the desk in here as well with a computer, believe it or not. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope, anyway, how's everyone doing? I hope everyone's doing really well. Um, what have you guys been building basically i want to see uh show me down below link me on twitter and i'll watch your videos i need things to watch at the moment uh because i've kind of resorted to not really watching much to the way of sims i've been watching a lot more like uh planet zoo and things like that so if you guys have got any like cool builds you've done or like youtubers you really like uh, just link me up and i'll have a I'll watch because i need some some something new some some, some inspiration at the moment um yeah so please 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 do and if you are enjoying this video at the moment please please like it uh subscribe and leave a comment down below and just engage engage like i i read every comment i reply to every comment uh everything on twitter i'll reply or respond to 
um, like I try to be as active as I can uh, with you guys because it's I think it's really cool just to build this little community and like, I've met so many good people so many lovely people on here so far and it just makes me so happy so happy that see there's so many people enjoying things the way that I'm enjoying it and seeing how passionate everyone is with everything I just I just absolutely love it I was gonna say thank you to everyone who supported me so far uh, even though that I've been posting less videos recently I'm trying to get back in to uploading more and more now I'm back at work and I'm used to it um, so I'm really hoping that you guys have uh, really like if you stuck by me thank you so much <laughs> Thank you so much, and if you follow me on Twitter, you always know what I'm doing, what I'm up to, and why I'm not uploading videos, basically. So I just say thank you so much to everything, um, all you guys. Would not be this happy without you guys just being here. Like, it, it, it's madness to me. Like, it's absolutely madness. Um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoy it. And uh, subscribe to me on Twitch as well, because... Uh, this build I, I did on Twitch originally, so if you want to see me build in live time, absolutely follow me on Twitch and give me your input, give me your ideas, and we'll, we'll be building. We're just going to be building. Um, I'm going to try and, I think I'm going to try and do Sim streams maybe once or twice a week. And at the moment I'm doing like a Pokemon Snap series as well, so Pokemon Snap will be uh, at least once a week. I might do it more depending on like how much time I've got. Um, because uh, that's a brilliant game. I've played through. I've played through it once, and I'm doing a replay through for everyone who wants to watch it. Uh, and it's such a good game. It's. I didn't think it was going to be as good as it is. I thought it was going to be kind of like the the first one, like you play it once and I'm done sort of thing. But there's a lot of replayability to it and challenges and things, which I think is really fun. Um, so I really hope you guys uh, join in for that. Like it's going to be really really good. It's just going to be really really good. I'm very excited. <laughs> um, I'm going to be doing Pokemon Snap. Uh, well, I'm filming this today on the 12th, and I'm going to be doing Pokemon Snap today. I'm going to be doing it later on this afternoon, so it's like 1 o'clock now, and I'm probably going to do it like maybe 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock. Uh, we're going to see. Can going to give myself a little break because it's the third video I'm filming in a row. <laughs> um, I'm just kind of trying to uh, bash out as much as I can, uh, really, uh, is the idea behind it. Uh, and my video, is, is it frozen or is it over? What's happened here? We're gonna keep going. Okay. Oh no, we're back here. That's very odd. Let's jump forward. Or was that the end? Oh, for some reason it is cut off there. So I I don't know why it's done that. Uh, that's not how I did it originally. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. Well, I'm gonna leave it there anyway because. I don't know what more to do, but you've seen it basically. Uh, if I get the the a better better uh, better better slide, a better screen, and um, you'll see what I mean. I mean now it's not even working, so I don't know. Um, either way, thank you so much for watching, guys. <laughs> I don't know what's happened there. Uh, it seems to be the file has gone a bit whack. If I'm honest with you. Um, but I'll put some screenshots on the end of this <laughs> uh, and you'll see what I mean and I'll put the end screen on but thank you so much for watching if you really enjoyed this video uh, like I say thumbs up subscribe comment down below and I shall see you guys again soon thank you so much guys see you later bye